Do we ever put pacemakers in children? Uh, we do. Pacemakers in, in children is, is relatively uh, rare. Uh, we uh, Children need pacemakers for several different reasons. Uh, some children are, are born with something called complete heart block, uh, where the electrical signals from the top chamber of the heart cannot go down to the bottom chamber of the heart, and the resulting heart rate is too slow. And, and that is uh, caused by a, a variety of, of different conditions. The, the most common thing uh, is that uh, some mothers may have something called uh, systemic lupus, uh, and uh, when this occurs, uh, they form antibodies uh, that cross the placenta and attack the child's electrical system uh, and uh, render it uh, inefficient. You make a good point because lupus peak is an arthritis, but it can affect virtually every part of the body. Is that true? Absolutely. Uh, systemic lupus has uh, uh, the potential for affecting uh, many, many organs, and in, in this case, even an, an unborn child. Uh, other than uh, lupus, uh, patients who have complex congenital heart disease uh, often undergo surgery, and uh, unfortunately, as a consequence of surgery, sometimes uh, patients also develop heart block and require pacemaker. A complete heart block without doing this, what would be the life expectancy of a kid like that? It, it varies. Uh, some children can do uh, very well, uh, but there is a, a risk of, of dying suddenly, uh, particularly if they have associated heart disease, uh, structural heart disease, that is. Uh, but the, the, there are several things that we need to keep in mind when evaluating a patient for a pacemaker, and that is what is their uh, average heart rate, what is their lowest heart rate, are there any times where there are many seconds in between one impulse and, and the next, uh, do they have a wide complex escape rhythm, meaning is the uh, rhythm that's like, sustaining the heart coming from the bottom chamber or somewhere uh, up higher in the normal electrical system, uh, and whether or not uh, the child has any extra beats coming from the bottom chamber or, or PVCs. All those things would put a patient at higher risk for developing a life-threatening situation.